wow hello merry christmas this is my first official christmas holiday themed video so welcome so nice to have you here although i already had a black friday haul that's thanksgiving that is over long ago never heard of her it is time for christmas the most wonderful time of the year as they say and with that comes gifts so that is why I'm here today to share with you guys my gift guide for her. Basically, this is for your girlfriend, your sister, your best friend, aunt, your mom, your grandma. These are just things to give you an idea of what to get someone. Or if you don't know what to ask someone, your boyfriend's asking you what do you want for Christmas and you're really not sure, then you can send him this link or write this down on a list and just be like, get me something from there or a couple things from there and you'll do a good job. So I did one of these last year, but this one's more like specific. These are gifts that if someone asks me oh what should I get this person this is what I would tell them to get actual gifts that I give people last year I was just listing a bunch of things although they're good ideas to give someone this video is like my real holiday gift guide and I'm really excited to share it with you guys because I love giving gifts I love seeing people's reactions to gifts and I personally think I'm a good gift giver I'm gonna give that to myself so whenever someone asks me for gift ideas this is always my go-to these are my favorite gifts to give and these are basically personalized baskets or bags they're kind of like goodie bags but more like personalized and specific to the person that you're giving it to i think these are the best types of gifts because they're a lot more thoughtful you're putting a bunch of items together that are like curated just for the person you're giving it to things that they like things that maybe they have tried before they like them but they may not like repurchase for themselves or a good mixture of both just a fair warning for you guys I filmed this video after drinking a cup of matcha and I was talking at warp speed, okay? I sounded like a crazy person because I was a crazy person. So just a disclaimer, we're on some James Charles type speak here. So obviously with these types of gifts, the cost can add up, although you're getting like a bunch of small little things, it can like add up to be over $50. So you just have to be smart with how much you're spending or if you do want to spend a lot, I have a lot of examples of like what you can do so what i'll do is get like one item that is like half the price like 25 bucks 30 bucks and they get a bunch of little things to like fill it in some things that might be like that 25 30 dollar item would be like gift sets so gift sets from sephora from ulta skincare or makeup or brush sets i like these because they are kind of like the main item they could be a gift just like on their own but it's just like the center piece of the whole basket and you're not only getting one item in it you're getting a bunch of little items but like i said sephora already has a bunch of sets but recently i saw that kylie skin and kylie cosmetics has a bunch of gift sets with mini products of all of her skincare items and also gift sets of her makeup i know one of them is like a lip liner a lipstick a blush and one of her cream eyeshadows and that's like a perfect gift right there so you could put a gift set in a basket or a bag and then put a bunch of little filler products these are what i like to call my little stocking stuffers so these could be chapsticks scrunchies fun socks another good stocking stuffer is a lush bath bomb if you buy just one bath bomb it's like three or four dollars and again a little five dollar gift it's a little self care moment some more stocking stuffers would be like face masks you could get these at target ulta just with single face masks sleep masks you could sleep anytime any place reusable straws i think a really good gift is a reusable straw i put in my amazon video reusable straw keychains so they could just put on their keys you get them a cute color and now they have reusable straw for on the go if they have airpods you get them an airpods case they sell these on amazon they're really inexpensive or you can put a pop socket in there i don't have a pop socket the people are into pop sockets five dollar starbucks gift cards that's like one of my favorite fillers it's because everyone likes getting gift cards and this one you don't have to spend a ton of money you're buying them one drink which is really nice it's like getting one of those free drink rewards and everyone loves that that's another thing that's only five bucks but it kind of upscales the basket coffee mugs and also candy so you get them at the dollar store you can also get them at target target has a little section of candy where they get like the boxes you get at the movie theater for only a dollar you get like two of those and it fills up your basket and now you have a gift set you have some scrunchies some chapstick you could spend like 10 15 dollars on those little fillers let's say the gift set was like 30 bucks that's like a 45 50 dollar gift i'm gonna give you guys an example of a gift that joelle got me last year that i freaking loved so she got me a little ole henriksen gift set it had like the little truth serum a moisturizer and a night cream then she put in the rings from old navy we love our old navy rings those are super good gifts because the rings are like eight ten dollars and they last way longer than the forever 21 rings so she gave me that and then she also gave me a disposable camera right now disposable camera is like one of the best stock stuffers I would say I think they're really fun maybe someone that isn't into it if you buy it for them they might start getting into them those are all the things that she got me and I thought it was an amazing gift so that is just an example now I'm gonna read off a bunch of things to you guys that I think these are good like main items in the basket so first summer Fridays masks I think these are a good gift 
for anyone and everyone, especially the jet lag mask. These masks are just so good and you don't even have to get them the full bottle. You can get them the sample size because a little goes a long way with these. And it really is a little luxury item that can be like the main part of a little basket. That's an idea. You can also get them nice slippers. I have been very, very into slippers recently. And I just think everyone likes to be comfy. So a nice pair of slippers, candles, they have a bunch of sales going on right now, Bath and Body Works. So I would go in there and like check out what they have. You get them a jade roller. The one that I have is from Skin gym these aren't expensive but they're not cheap they're not like the little filler items they're a nice little self-care gift another thing i put in here are the jeffree star makeup mirrors they have a new one with shane dawson that's the pig mirror these are super cute and they're huge they're gonna like when you put it in a basket it's gonna make it seem like you give them a whole damn prize you could get them a reusable cup i know hydro flask has a new like zippy cups they kind of look like the starbucks cups you can get them one of their favorite color if they like sparkles you can get them a sparkly one if they just like simple things you get them like the black matte one which is really nice so you can put the cup, $5 Starbucks gift card, and a bunch of little filler items, maybe a disposable camera, some candy, maybe a scrunchie, and got a whole little gift right there. Any like Lush product, their Rose Jam, anything of their Rose Jam smells so good. Again, I just love self-care gifts because it's also telling the person like, you know, I care about your health. You deserve this. You deserve to relax. You can get them a waffle maker. I have a little mini waffle maker. It was like 10 bucks at Target, and I use it all the freaking time. A Himalayan salt lamp. I got mine on Amazon. It was like 20 bucks, 25 bucks. Bucks. This is like a perfect gift because they look so cute in your room. They bring the good vibes They help you go to sleep and again something someone might not think to buy themselves But it's a really nice thing to have you give them a gift receipt to their nail salon or just like cash or a visa card Be like here you go. Go get your nails done. Enjoy yourself. You get them an Amazon I almost said you guys know what I mean. They're not too expensive. They are on like a pricier side But I think it's a nice present if they don't have one already a gas card. Okay guys, it is 2019 the gas is expensive a practical adult thing get me a freaking gas card please i need it i really need it last thing you get them a lip balm my favorite lip slippy mask from laneige that's a 20 dollars gift and that is again a little luxe item next thing i have for you guys are more expensive items that you can put it in baskets if you want if you want to spend a lot of money on them or if you don't want to spend a lot but you want to get them a nice thing then these are some suggestions a skincare fridge so i've talked about this before I don't know why I'm so obsessed with these. The one I have from Amazon is $50. This is so good. Again, it's something that someone might not buy from themselves. They might be like, I don't need that. But if you get it from someone, you're like, wow. I needed that. Someone told me there are cheaper ones that you can get online, so you can do your research, but the one I have is from Amazon. $50. A really good gift. Next thing I have on here is one of those star lights from Amazon. I don't know if you guys have seen these. I've seen these on TikTok. I know Chantel Jeffries has one too, but they're basically like these lights, and you could put them like on your counter, plug it in, and it like projects lights on your ceiling. So when you go to sleep, you can look up and you're looking at the freaking stars, not the actual stars. But it seems like it. This is on trend right now, but you get them a Disney Plus subscription. I have been paying for my own Disney Plus subscription, but if someone else like bought me a year of it, sister, I love you. You get them Key Australia sunglasses. The Desi High Keys are always a staple. A pair of sunglasses from them is like 60 bucks. Or if they do a lot of work on the computer and they don't already have blue light glasses, Key Australia sells blue light glasses and that's also a good gift. Phone cases. Wildflower or Casetify? Your choice. Honestly, recently I've really been liking Casetify cases and what I really like about them for gifts is that they have custom cases. So I don't know if you guys have seen the ones that, that are mirrors and you can put like text at the bottom, you can put their name. I love this because it's not just a phone case. It's not like a phone case is a really good gift, but it's also customized, personalized. You can get them a ring light. I need a ring light. My ring light is broken. If they're into makeup, if they want to start a YouTube channel, buy them a ring light. It's going to be such a great thing to get and they're going to get so much use out of it. You can get them, of course, out of everything, a makeup palette. This is just like, this is obvious, but an example that I think is a really, really good gift is the Tati Beauty palette. I think it's sold out right now. Hopefully she comes back in stock before Christmas, but this palette is beautiful and it's such a perfect like starter palette you have everything in there you can bring it with you, you got like I am so proud of her this palette is so good especially for us neutral girls it's just the perfect soft glam can be full glam palette and honestly when it's back in stock I need to purchase it but as a gift Thank you so much. And Ugg slippers. Guys, I saw a pair of Ugg slippers yesterday. You guys know which ones I'm talking about. All the influencers are wearing them and I want them. They're definitely not something I would buy for myself because they are $100. But like I said, I'm really into slippers. And these are ones that you can wear outside of the house. They have like the hard soles. They're amazing. They look so comfy. So Ugg slippers. 
as a clothing piece do you get them is any type of coat jacket a teddy coat is really nice i know they have ones at target now that are like 20 30 dollars especially being winter these are a good thing to have you get them a pajama set i know some people might think pajama sets are like not a really good gift but if i got one a cozy pajama set silky ones flannel ones all of the above i love all of them you get them a pair of slides slides are like an in-between you're getting them shoes but they're not like too expensive and slides you wear them all the time and my last $50 item I want to share with you guys is the FabFitFun box so actually this video is partnered with FabFitFun if you guys don't know who they are they're basically a subscription service that is $50 every month and you get a big box filled with over $200 worth of products so this is the perfect gift because just like the other examples I was giving you guys this is not just one gift you're getting a bunch of different little things that they could try out things that they've heard of maybe things that they never thought of trying and today actually I have a fit fun box that I haven't opened yet so we're gonna have a first look together so this is actually my first time getting a fab fit fun box so I don't really know what to expect in here I know that they're gonna be a bunch of products worth over $200 but I don't know like what's in it yet so let's see together oh wait I need to open it <laughs> Ooh. oh hi gorgeous how are you hello and we have some discount codes in here we have a $30 gift card to Sterling Forever and oh HelloFresh I've never tried HelloFresh before this is a $90 gift card I might have to use that because I literally hear all like youtubers talking about this and I want to try it out myself so we might have to use that I hate opening packaging like it's so nice and pretty <gasps> Oh my gosh, okay. Okay, 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 what do I see first? What do I see first? Okay, I see a candle. Jonathan Adler Fleur de Sel scented candle. This is fancy. Okay, like we said, candles. Perfect gift. This one looks expensive too. This ain't no bath and body works. This is a perfect like bathroom candle, you know? Oh, that's amazing. Okay, okay, what's next? What's next? Here, soft focus glow drops from Rodial. I've never heard of them before. Illuminating ultimate glow primer. I've never had one of these before. Okay, I'm gonna put it on my hand. Am I like a beauty guru? Oh my gosh. Ooh, I like that. Cause it's not like glittery. I'm always nervous of these being like too glowy and I'm just gonna look like a freaking disco ball. This one just looks so nice. I'm gonna use her. It smells like oranges. Tangerines? Tangerines. Now, oh my gosh, I need one of these. This is a color switch instant brush cleaner. I need this because I hate cleaning my brushes and recently I got the Jeffree Star Jane Dawson palette and I don't have a lot of eyeshadow brushes so I'm like limited I can only use one color on each brush but now why can't I open this now I can do a little you know a little swirly swirl and it cleans your brushes well I already see this a makeup eraser I already have one of these I have a black one so now I got a pink one these are really good you just like wet them with water and then they take off your makeup no need for makeup wipes and they're super soft this is also like a good little you know for the baskets you know what I mean what is this prep rally prime prime and prep detangler i need a detangler this one oh this one's from dry bar if you guys don't know what dry bar is it's like a hair salon that only blow dries and styles hair so i expect this to be good formulated with biotin vitamin b and c and uv blockers yes this is a calm and clean epsom salt wait epsom salt hand and body wash with lavender oil okay we need to smell her Ooh, that smells like self-care to me. Okay, this is a body wash from Kukio. What do we have here? Oh my gosh. I was literally just talking about this, you guys. It's a Bluetooth shower speaker from Bando. I'm so excited about this. This one's so cute too. Oh my gosh. I've been wanting one of these for so long because once I come back from the gym, usually I haven't like finished listening to my podcast. So when I get in the shower after the gym, I can listen to my podcast when I'm in the shower. Amazing. This is the best. This is the last thing. Ooh. Makeup pa it's an eyeshadow palette from Beauty Bakery. Proof is in the pudding. Ooh. The tones. The tones 
are just right, you guys. And that, you guys, is everything that is in my Fat Fit Fun box. So like I said before, each box is $50 filled with $200 worth of stuff each time. And if you guys want a Fat Fit Fun box, either buy for yourself or buy for a loved one. This is like perfect for a mom. Or tell your mom and be like, mom, we need to get one of these for all our aunties, all our grammys. They're going to love this. And you guys can use my code LRA10 for $10 off your first Fat Fit Fun box. So that, you guys, is Fat Fit Fun. I just want to thank them again for partnering with me with this video. Another thing you could put in there is a little DIY gift. So this is like the most meaningful gift out of all of them. My favorite example of this is a picture so I get my picture frames from either Target or Walmart they're like two or three dollars then you can go print out a picture at Walgreens it's like a couple bucks and then right there in like five dollars you have a very personalized gift that they could put up in their room it's just my favorite thing to give them a picture frame I'm gonna give you guys an example of a gift that I gave my mom this was for Mother's Day but it could work for Christmas as well I got her a basket I put a candle in it put some slippers I put a lush bath bomb in there and then I put a picture frame of us in there one of my favorite pictures of us and that woman loved it moms are suckers for personalized gifts of course and they're suckers for anything like self-care because they deserve it as well as need it i want to end off today's video with a couple ideas for mom gifts going off of the fab fit fun that is one amazing gift a couple things i'm just going to read off are necklaces with their kids initials on it i don't know why i didn't put this idea in the video i kind of did with the mom with the kids initials but initial necklaces and name necklaces so freaking cute i'm gonna put a bunch of different websites where you can get these necklaces from one year i got my mom a necklace that had my brother's first initial on it and my first initial on it and she loved it i always wear my e necklace and you guys always ask me where i got it from so i'm gonna leave you a couple different places where you can get necklaces like that even if it's not like the boyfriend's initial if it's just your initial or your name um, I think that's super cute. A blanket or pillow with a picture of you and your siblings on it. You can get her a teddy coat. My mom steals my teddy coat, so I'm gonna have to get her one for Christmas. Sorry, mom, if you're watching this. I need my teddy coat back. You can get them anything, aromatherapy, bath bombs. Moms need the relaxation. An air fryer. If you don't have one of these already, what are you doing? Air fryers are amazing. And lastly, you get them a personalized wine glass. So I got one of these for my Nana last year. She freaking loves it. It says Nana's wine on it. it was literally like 10 bucks i think with shipping it came out to like 15 20 dollars it was like a pretty nice wine glass like i don't know a lot about wine glasses but it works pretty sure it gets the job done and that you guys i think that is everything that is on my list i hope this was specific enough for you guys i want to be more specific i want to give you guys good ideas so i hope that I did the job, but that is my gift guide. Those are all my ideas and examples of gifts that I've given to people or gifts that people have given to me. And I hope you find this helpful. If you guys enjoyed watching today's video, please give it a thumbs up. Comment down below anything you would like. Follow me on all my social medias. They'll be linked in the description down below as well as somewhere on the screen. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.